don't know you can hear me. Is that your new tape? Star Lord. Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the space riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your space rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out. Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma. What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm hmm. Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and. You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. Stop doing this, man. It's weird. We are approaching the quarantine zone. How long was I out for? 15,338 ticks. That's very specific. The betrayer is ready to begin our mission. She has requested your presence in the cockpit. Gamora's on our side, Drax. She is the spawn of my sworn enemy, a murderess and a traitor. I do not trust her.
So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done strategizing, feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Once we've reached that force field, there's no going back. Your black market codes are gonna crack that Nova net, right? Yep. As soon as you enter them in your console. Okay, here we go. Rocket Groot Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Core security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. And if we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Nova net still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. 0451. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption. There. very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy-duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so pure. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Roland. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overall. Plus, there's good money in it. The piece that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoth 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like the mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <clears throat> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Group Quill Suda. Team Rockets up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the Assassin. Ugh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? What? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop side. The ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, group. <laughs> Don't worry. Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle, and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. Baby. It's a ship, Peter, not a child. Oh, oh. can you imagine? Are you good? What, the pink goo? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. Just imagine what kind of blasters the Shadari had to use to wreck some of these frigates. I am being insensitive. The 
thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... pink goo. Ebrium-based nanoresin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. Oh, look! Yellow and blue! Looks like an old Novacore frigate. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why'd he even bring us here if the place is so sacred? I can name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so why here? You think it's to impress Gamora? Like, hey, check out the serious intel I got from, you know, shady sources. Don't know if you noticed, Rocket, but people aren't exactly falling over themselves to hire us. Oh, I have noticed. If this job pans out, sure we'll get money, but also a rich new client. We need to impress Lady Hellbender with a monster she's interested in, not just any old critter. Which is why we should have gone after Fin Fang. Whoa! I'm okay! Ha! <laughs> Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. You know, I like this. This is fun. The three of us, hanging out. Just like when we started this gig. Before you know who joined us. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a swell guy. Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Is that why your plan has Drax and I taking the ship? Maybe. Hey, can't a guy want to spend some quality time with his friends? It is strange. I have not encountered any corpses in the wreckage. Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Eh, uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on. How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, group, you think we can find pieces of the Trion Shard in here? I'm good. You never heard of the Trion Shard? Pyramid of pure evil that corrupts everything it comes in contact with. I'm good. Making things up. Name one time I ever made something up. I'm good. I'm good. I am good. Ah, shut up. Ask Amora. How'd you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. Yeah, I'm sure it's safe-ish. Safer than flying with Kimura, anyway. I heard that. Ship-eating parasites. Flarkas would chew right through the Milano in two cycles. Looks like they've got. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> nice splatter. Hey, 50 units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Whoa, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? Considering how many times I fixed the Flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant hole where this ship's cockpit used to be. Well, that's grim. Uh, yeah, try not to think about it. It's better not to wonder what happened to anyone working on these old wrecks. It was a long time ago anyway. Just, uh, thought I saw a shortcut. shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. 
There's a crapped out Novacore missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. How's Team Rocket doing down there? We're fine. Waiting for Quill to show up. Your team was tasked with keeping Peter Quill safe. Am I supposed to fall in holes instead of him? Yes. His fragile Terran frame cannot handle the impact. Yeah. Okay. Crawling through creepy old ship. No big deal. Easy there, Quill. Pretty sure nothing's gonna jump out at you. Except maybe me and Groot. Fly the ship. And so far, I haven't abandoned you while you're on the ground. Are you trying to bring the whole place down, Quill? I shot a thing. I get it. First tool in the old toolbox. Ooh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Aw, oh, hey, little guy. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck? You dead, Quill? We can hear your wussy squeal even without the car. Little busy! Crap! That's cheating! You guys should have seen that. It was this weird blobby thing. <laughs> Not falling for this again. Sorry to burst your bubble! or something. Should have heard him squeal. You must fight with dignity, Peter Quill. Or at least die with it. Not funny. After we catch this monster, we really should spend half a cycle loading up the Milano with tech. The longer we stay here, the higher the chances of us getting caught. Yeah, yeah. Well, we got a lot riding on your gal pal's mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. Like you could even tell if she had an honest face. Trust in the plan, guys. Everything is checked out so far, right down to the mining ship. We'll put our thumpers in the right places and we'll bag that monster. Uh, Quill knows all about the mother of Scott! Are you kidding me? Son of a smash! That was too close! You okay, Groot? Well, we're fine, but we can't jump that. You don't gotta jump. There's a sturdy support beam on this side. Get Groot to grow a bridge across. Just ask him nice like. He does it for me all the time. All right, Groot. Let's see that cool vine. <laughs> One hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross. More ship eaters. Ah, oh, they're everywhere. All right. Boom. Right under your nose, Quill. I'm Groot. Of course we're going the right way. Just keep your eyes on that mining ship. That's where we want to end up. What's a mining ship doing in the middle of all these fighters, anyway? Groot, I found a hitch. Can you latch onto it? Hey, Greenies. You see any blue and gold ships out there, you'll let us know. 
We have seen many such ships. He means active ones. We haven't talked about what to do if we run into a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we will restrain them until we are done here. Bad idea. Those cops are all connected through their stupid helmets. If they do spot us, all they have to do is close that barrier and we're stuck in here with the rest of the graveyard. If you see cops, you get my ship out of here. Even if it means leaving us behind. Ah, uh, flock that! Trust me, I've dealt with Nova Corps before. Even helped them catch real criminals. I can talk my way out. You think that Milano can outrun a fully powered Nova Centurion? She's done it before. How do we know the monster we're looking for ain't one of these things we already killed? If it were worthy of li- Okay, here we go. All right, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. Flark! No, no! Flark and Skaggy! Kratak and batteries fried, that's what's wrong. Maybe you put it down too hard. Let's just find a solution. The solution's a new battery, with a charge. Okay, we're on what's left of a ship. Full of ship things. Gotta be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. You find a replacement while I finish scraping the fried wires. So much for that. So, Drax, how come you're so in love with this Hellbender lady? I do not love Lady Hellbender. Yeah, shouldn't you be all like, Her name is illogical. You cannot bend hell. Found something with a charge. Kind of looks like a spacey car battery. Okay, this thing isn't going to zap me, right? The chance is minuscule at best. You'll be fine. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So, uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Rocket! Help me scramble some critters! No, 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 Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, it's gonna short circuit! Rocket launch! Away from me! Uh, I'd rather just run away than be anywhere! Stop! They're really coming out of the woodwork! These numbers have got to be a rude way to call! Bye bye, little guy! Come on, you hunkin' cop! Take your time! Not like we're busy here! Thanks for the heads up, bud! Good! Use that spear! Kill them all! to see you fix it next time. Come on, two down, two to go. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? If the two of us gotta lug that monster all the way to Lady Hellbender? Guys! We deliver this monster to Lady Hellbender, we'll get bigger payouts, and jobs that don't suck. A ship for each one of us! I mean, a team only needs one ship. Perhaps a more spacious ship. Man! That thing is ridiculous! 
Think it was a ship or a robot? That's a Cree Sentry. A robot, but it would have been space worth. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. Plus half a dozen Mega Sentry prototypes. How do you know all this? Because they were my fellow experiments back on Half World. Most of my parts came from the cybernetics hangar next to the door, so uh, I got a sneak peek at all the new killbots. I can see the parts come and go from my, uh, uh, my cage. I didn't mean to open old wounds. Ah, most of them are just scars now, anyways. I wasn't even a person to the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. More like a real smart walking gun. A very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. The entire facility was the problem. I wish I'd gone back and blown it up before the end of the war. Of course there ain't any plants here. It's a junkyard. Plants grow where they got food. This place is nothing but square oh, load of this rocket. Hey, no, they couldn't live off the goo. Don't worry, I ain't even gotten serious yet. No, this Imperians probably had to tow all the scrap to one place. Sure, not really their job description, but Nova was spread pretty thin after the war. Hey, kept them off of my tail at least. Groot, need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Wait, is that... Yes! I'm about to win this bet, Quill! Here goes nothing. <laughs> We're inside a giant robot head. And I got robot parts inside my head! You have robot parts inside your head. BAM! <laughs> hey, Groot, what do you think I should do when I win this bet? I mean with the units he'll owe me once I win. Well, I know what I'll be doing with my winnings. I'm saving up for our next stop on Contraxia to get one of those Zeronian massages. Uh, you're so predictable. Wonder how many big bot carcasses we'd find looking around the entire zone. Found a nest! Maybe this is the Parasite Clubhouse! I'm having the time of my life. Quill! Shoot down a nest if you're having fun! Speak for itself. I am crushing this! Don't congratulate him! What do you think, Drax? Should we get in on this bet? Think of all the hyper circuits you can buy. Are you making fun of me? I do not wish to acquire hyper circuits. Hey, Rocket! Didn't you say you were at least twice as good a shot as me? And just so we're clear, Green Team is officially ineligible for the bet. Why? Well, for one, you need a gun. I have no need for a projectile weapon. Hey, 
exactly. You suck, Star Tribe. Were I allowed to participate? I think I'd spend my bet earnings on a night at Liteco. That's only if you manage to beat me. Wait, isn't Liteco a fancy pants restaurant out on Vega? I am so sick of Yarra Root. Imagine something this big coming at you. A whole ship was like a bug by comparison. You know what, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points should count double from now on. That's cheating. All right, Thumper goes there, Quill. It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. Rocket! I only flipped the switch on and off to see if it started! Yeah, tell the- Gotta love that kill rate! Stop them short! How are there this many of them? About to be one less! One last freaky eye thing! Coming! Not a chance! I heard it! I thought we were safe! Oh, come on! Now we gotta deal with junk slugs? Don't gawk at it! Shoot it! Very helpful, thanks! You're welcome! Now stop distracting me! Yeah. I knew I was missing all the fun last time! Watch out! Worm things go boom! Stick it to a group! We really need to test these things! Rocket! New them! <laughs> oh yeah! like that time. <laughs> At least they make a good flag. Oh, oh yeah. I'm gonna murderize the lot of you. I eat fucks like you for breakfast. Um, how many times have I saved your butt now? Oh, thanks, buddy. Surprise, bro! How are there this many of them? Perhaps they were exertion for the most ready! Oh, you are Nice splatter, Rocket! I know, right? What was that worth? Five points? Oh, come on! You can't just give yourself points like that! It looks like we're done installing our thumb. Great job. We'll meet you at the mining ship. All right, mining rig is right there. Of course it's secure. As secure as a broke down Shatari shipwreck's ever gonna be. That's because you keep calling it gooey stuff. It's nano resin. I am Groot. Come on, Groot. We need to get across here. And Rocket wouldn't put you at risk, right? I am Groot. That's right. I've always got your back, bud. I am Groot. Nah, it just looks unstable like everything else in here. Don't get your twigs in a bundle. Yes! The resin can hold a stupid warship! 
I'm telling you, it's totally safe. See? I'll even prove it. Huh? Look at this. Rocket? Oh, fuck. Guys, jump! No, no! no. Ah! Says I'll meet us at the mining ship. I don't want to make him wait. That's it? We're not going after him? He says it's fine. We'll meet him later. Team Rocket, is everything okay? The signal just went dark. His radio must have broke when he fell. What happened to your timber companion? He ain't timber. He's alive. So? I, I really don't know if you're being clever or dumb right now. Team Rocket, out. <sighs> Sounds like green team's off our backs. Now we can stop worrying about that, uh, dumb exit. Fruit's fine anyways. There's nothing to worry about. An accident rocket? Come on! What? That's all it was. It's your fault! If you hadn't fooled around on that ship... I did it. You don't know nothing. Stop trying to be smart. That sure didn't sound like an apology. Nope! Man! If that afterburner kicked on right now, we'd be toast. Let's hope it don't, because we have to find a way through this thing. Mining ships on the other side of that turbine, so we gotta find a way through. Try not to jump on anything this time. Groot's not there to grab you if you... Well, either shut up or help me figure out how these blades open. I can hear your visor working. Better not be cheating on our bet, Quill. How can you hear that? There's a drone access tunnel over here. <sighs> can you squeeze in there? Knew it. Rocket, fix the thing. Rocket, clean up the mess. Rocket, crawl into the mystery hole. See anything? Yeah, a manual override. Team Rocket, we hit a snag. One of our thumper points was covered in resin, so we're gonna fly around and scout another spot. Just make sure the new spot as close as possible to the original one. Because of mass and angle. Great. Another turbine. Yeah, that is how these things are usually built. And... Someone's been practicing. Floor! It's stuck on something! Come on! Let's get out of here! We're back on track. The mining ship ain't too far. Think Groot's already ahead of us? Maybe. Hope he didn't get distracted. I've been thinking about buying him a leaf. It wasn't me this time, I swear! I don't like this! Watch for me! That point don't count before death! I told you I saw them. Great timing! How did you guys... Good to see you two, but you're gonna want to cross the ship as fast as you can. We're seeing a lot of movement! Yeah, Scott's getting real violent out here. Uh, just try to hold her still for us! That's not gonna be an option soon! This position is untenable. Drax says incoming! Watch out! What? Hang on! Running! Yeah. Stop walking around, man! Really? Well, 
make it inside? Yeah. All in one piece. <sighs> ah, crap! What? My visor went supernova. Is it broken? Uh, overload, it sounds like. Must be some kind of residual energy in here. Uh, come on! Flark and tensor joint! Just sneak! Uh, wiggle the... Uh, okay, so life support's moving back up. What's it look like out there? Oh, mother of space! Just... old cleaner bots maybe old cleaner bots you don't know <laughs> <laughs> Thought you were that freaky thing we accidentally released. Saw! We saw some cleaner bots. <laughs> accidentally. At a distance. We're totally alright. <laughs> yep. Just a freaky floating creature. Nothing to worry about. Oh, and speaking of freaky creatures, wanna bet green team's having trouble parking the ship? I think I'm done with uh, bets for today. Yeah, you and me both. Let's just get to the rendezvous point. Uh, nobody won. It was just an excuse to shoot stuff. Green team better be showing up soon. You didn't see them? They better not have left us in here by ourselves. There you go. Rendezvous coordinates are that way. But we'll have to find a way around the rubble. I'll try to find a side passage. Look at this old beauty. I am Groot. A table. This is a vintage Model T engineering workbench. They don't make them sturdy like that no more. Hey, come on, Quill. Let's see if this beauty still works. Maybe I can fix up your gear. Hey, hand me that part. Get here, buddy. Yeah, there's a way through if we can clear out that crud. Eh, that's one stubborn bunch of lore. Try that quick cooldown I installed so you can keep pelping it. Mining ship. A mining mining ship. Cut rock, extract resources. Do you see any rock? Or mining equipment for that matter? Well, no.
you gotta time this just right to overcharge the phase cooling. And, uh, thanks for the upgrade. All right, let's squeeze our way out of here. Oh, after you. Uh, no, you go first. I'll cover your back. Uh, seems a little wobbly. You guys hang back a sec. Well, Scott! Ugh, this place is crawling with ugly! Guys, I'm not alone down here! Bunch of stuff to mine. What was it? I don't know. Weird QB hunks of rock or metal. Peter Quill, I have located some old equipment, but I do not see you. This whole place is old equipment. Let's not narrow my search. Huh. I wonder if Rocket knows what this is. not a question of luck. Peter, make some noise so we can find you. Drax? Drax? Hey, you want to mute your comms if you're going to scream your lungs out? Thumper spot. We'll head that way and keep an eye out for you. How's my baby? You can see for yourself if we can get back up there. All right. Pretty sure that baby's our ticket upward. 
Somehow. It's a possibility. Maybe try something else. I could make it up there, but we're gonna need something for you two to climb up on. It is a wonder the nimble assassin has not abandoned us already. Drax. At least he called me nimble. It's not intended to some copy. Anyone got any bright ideas? If you're not gonna use that vibe... Let's see that fancy footwork, Gamora. Bet you can't do this. That is physically impossible. Drax, think you can heft that container? Behold the might of a Katathian warrior! Can you move it over there? Done. Well, that's helpful. I did as our leader bid. Not all of us are so quick to disobey. Make up your mind. Are you mad I served Thanos, or that I betrayed him? Neither inspire confidence. Hold that for me, bud. Where shall I relocate it? You can place it there. Understood. Remember this moment, should you ever think of crossing me, assassin. I'll remember how slowly you... This one's all you. Probably here. I am on my way. Huh. All right, Rocket. We're back on track. Huh? Oh, yeah. Uh, good for you. I am good. It ain't stealing if it's abandoned. We. Oh, Flark. Rocket. Not now, Quill. Rocket? Perhaps he has located our monster. We don't even know what it looks like. The intel was extremely vague. It wasn't vague, it was... rushed. It's probably some cute little... Nightmarish abomination. Lady Hellbender is a renowned warrior. An ideal specimen would reflect that strength. Like I said, something scary. I disagree. Strength is endearing. My little Camaria and her mother Hovat were two of the strongest people who ever lived. With a name like Hellbender, Gamora's probably right. It's gotta be something scary. Nightmarish. A proper apex predator. Snarling and nasty. More teeth than all of us combined. Bat-like wings with razor tips. Probably spits poison or acid. Or acidic poison. I hope all these are true. I yearn for a worthy challenge. <laughs> 